Okay, so I'm going <clears throat> to give you a update of my speckled swan gourds and birdhouse gourds. Um, this is, I think, the second update of this patch. Um, it's September 11th, 2011, so getting close to the end of the season. And I just want to show you what all I've got so far. There's a pretty big swan gourd. Here's another one. Um, I've got a lot of the swan gourds. They are, they're almost my favorite thing to grow. I think they're so neat. Um, the birdhouse gourds, they, or the apple gourds, grew a lot of them, but they weren't apple gourds. They were cross-pollinated, I'd say, from the seeds that I saved. And a lot of them look like this. They just look like long gourds. Some of them do look like apple gourds, like this one. It's kind of small. Here's another one that looks like an apple gourd. Yeah, just had some funny shapes with those. Another one. Um, been impressed with the speckled swan gourds. I didn't plant very many of them. But I did get a lot of them. I don't really know what to call the apple gourds. I guess just long gourds. I don't know. They're kind of their own little species now. Oh, and those butternut squash things that I didn't know what they're called. I just call them butternut squashes. Um, they're doing pretty good. I got a lot of them. I can't really find any right now. Here's one. That's a really long one. Um... Kind of hard to find. They're in the middle of all of this weeds and everything. But yeah, this is probably my last update of this little bird or apple gourds and swan gourds. The last update because the next time you see them, they will probably be picked and ready to sell. So that's it from the apple gourd and swan gourds.